HMPV, human metanemo virus, the new virus outbreak in China. Let's break it down. First of all, you should know that this is not any new virus or new strain. It has been detected in 2001 in Netherlands. And from that time, it has been into human circulation causing respiratory infections. It belongs to family Paramyxoviridae, which includes viruses like RSV and measles. Now we have seen its recent outbreak in China, but spikes have been seen in India, USA, UK and many other countries. If we go by its previous data available, the HMPV virus shows seasonal patterns. Here in this graph, we can see it peaks in the winter season, mostly in the temperate regions and subtropical regions. That's the same thing going on now. We are in a January. And in this graph, we can analyze that it has previously peaked in these times. But you know, there are anomalies. Anomalies can occur leading to off-season outbreaks also. Like we have seen in 2008 in China, it peaked in May, suggesting spring prevalence. You know, this is virus. It can mutate. It can adapt to any seasons, no matter what. That's what makes these single-stranded RNA viruses more lethal or virulent. This HMPV is single-stranded RNA virus. And single-stranded viruses are more lethal than any other viruses. Due to its high mutation rates, because it lacks proofreading, it exhibits efficient replication, it has advanced immune evasion, it has cytopathic effects, it shows zoonotic origins and adaptability, and many more parameters. Now talking about recent outbreaks. We have seen rising cases in China, USA, UK and India. We see in China 6.2% weekly testers returned HMPV positive. Rising cases among children include aged between 12 to 15. In USA, we see 1.94% weekly testers returned HMPV positive. Then in India, we have seen few cases like we have seen cases in Karnataka, Tamil Nadu, Gujarat, Maharashtra and West Bengal. And mostly these cases have been observed in infants and children. And in UK, we have seen 4.5% of rising cases weekly. So these are the numbers available as of now for HMPV virus. But it's still premature to say it can prove lethal as SARS-CoV-2 or COVID-19. Till now, it has no comparison with SARS-CoV-2 or COVID-19 because COVID-19 has broader spectrum of symptoms than HMPV. The initial symptoms of HMPV includes cough, fever, runny nose, sore throat, headache. And more severe symptoms includes difficulty breathing, wheezing, fever, bronchitis, pneumonia. And people who are most susceptible includes children, old aged people that are 65 plus and immunocompromised individuals. So at the end we can say no need to fear as of now. It has no comparison with COVID-19 yet. It's still far away from being called lethal. Stay updated. Thanks.